About an hour ago, the Kern County Board of Supervisors approved the Raceway 2.0 solar project in Rosamond, which has been a process a few years in the making. It will be about 1,250 acres and can generate about 271 megawatts of energy. The proposal says that about 680,000 solar panels would be installed and about 200 people would be needed for construction, but only four full-time employees would be needed for maintenance and construction after the project is built. This all taking place in Supervisor Zach Scrivener's district, and he says most of the solar projects in the past eight years have been in his district. His main concern with the proposal was the proximity to homes, but through this back and forth process, AES says they have tried to move the project as far away from residences as possible. I think the real game changer in this project, in addition to how the developer agreed to move, um, to remove several, um, several areas where this project was going to go, the real game changer to me um, is the construction of the battery storage. Um, the construction of this storage is going to add significant fiscal benefits to the project as the solar tax exclusion does not apply. And the solar tax exclusion means that a solar project won't have to pay property taxes, but the battery storage facility would have to. The county estimates that the fiscal benefits from the project are a one-time sales tax of $1.5 million. Annual property taxes, that would amount to about $19 million over the 30-year life of the project and a one-time cumulative impact charge of about $800,000. Now coming up at 6, we have more on the Raceway 2.0 solar project and when the county expects it to be completed by plus some why some people are against this move.